Hey everyone, it's me Connie and we're going to make a journal and we're going to do it um, the journal that I want to give away for my uh, thousand subscribers and um, I will uh, when I, when we totally get through with it um, and I do a run through that will be the um, the uh, video for you to make comments on and then we'll do the comment picker like a week later okay so let's make this journal and what i'm going to be using just in case you want to make one too um i'm using the um sepia and ivory journal kit from my porch print but i'm not using like um all the pages i'm just going to make a small one and then also um i have some of the uh the ephemera uh, add-on kit that we'll be adding to the inside of the pages when we get it done. Also, I have this one. This is, um, uh, I think it's a prayer journal kit, if I'm not mistaken, under my porch prints. And um, I'm going to use these as well as little filler page pages. I have two coffee stain sheets that I'm possibly going to throw them in there. Um... Here are the pages I'm using, uh, and I printed some coffee stain on the back. So, uh-oh, look what my printer did. Y'all, I'm going to use it. I'm going to use it. I'm so sorry, but I'm going to use it. There's that. I might uh, print it over, because I don't want y'all to get that. Whoever's going to get it, I don't want them to see, get a messed up page. I'll put this to the side so I'll know to reprint it. There's that, there's that, there's that. Oops, and we got an empty page. Oh my goodness, these didn't get done on the back. We're going to redo those, run those through on the back. Okay, so I will um, reprint those. And um, so anyway, that is that. So y'all know what we got, what I'm going to be using, and um, here is what I'm going to be using for my cover. This is going to be the outside. This is going to be the inside of the cover, so it's going to be like this, okay? And then I got some tie back, and I put some sticky uh, tape on both sides of it, so that's going to be sandwiched in between, and... Um, so there's that but before we do anything i want to cut the edges and i also want to ink it up so let's do that we're just going to make the um cover today and um that'll be that for today okay we're going to do just that for the cover and I'm going to cut them both at the same time. I'm making sure this wide piece and this wide piece is on the same. You know, even though it's a little upside down, it doesn't matter. I'm going to, I just want both pieces to be the exact same. So there we go. We're going to cut away. And then we're going to also add... Um, we're going to... Um, put it together and I'm going to sew around the edges and then the cover will be done. So this is how I'm going to make the cover. Just so you know, I like to cut both pieces at the same time so I know that they are exactly the same size. Now when we get ready to do the pages, we're going to have to cut those down just a little bit because they're the exact same size as this. So we'll end up cutting that down um, just a little bit because um, we want the pages to be a little smaller than, um, there we go. There it is. That's going to be the outside and this will be the inside. So there we go. Woohoo! We're getting started. All right. Let me ink away. So I hope y'all like this um, this journal. It's gonna be, you know, it's gonna be smaller. It's not gonna have tons of pages. Um, I usually the ones that um, I sell, there's like 
40 pages, 35 pages, but that's not including the small pages either. A lot of times it's just so fat that, um, you know, it's crazy. So I'm inking around the edges and um, I want to ink around the inside as well. So if they don't match up perfectly, they will, um, it will be all right. Let me get this and just do this number on the inside. That will take some of the time frame off. And I need a new, uh, I need to put a new sponge on here. I have some, I just haven't done it yet. Y'all, oy, isn't that crazy? Oh my goodness. Okay, so I have been having Christmas movies on all day. Unbelievable. All right, that's so beautiful. I love it. Love, love, love it. All right. The thing about putting this together, it freaks me out. Every time I make a, a cover, I'm like, oh my goodness, is it going to match up? Am I going to be off a little bit? But what I like to do is um, add a little bit of um, Fabri-Tac to it so that possibly um, it will uh, help on me being unable to move it a little bit just in case it's off. I don't um, smush it down until... Um, let me get clean that off because all right here we go because i don't um smoosh it until uh um i know it's lined up pretty good as best i can you know what it is a it's a homemade from the heart kind of thing and if it's not perfect, it's just part of the charm. It's just part of the charm. So I'm going to get the cover made and then I will reprint the page that um, got messed up. And I will do the next video will be the pages, me cutting the pages and sewing the pages in. So that'll be that. Okay. All right. So it's going to go like that. And we could just stick it together and be done with it. But I know I go the extra mile because I, I, I don't know why I do this. I mean, it is what it is. Um, I need to cut just a little bit more off of that part because I don't want it to... Um, I don't want it to gum up my, um, there we go. We're going to stick it down just like that. I don't want it to gum up my, um, sewing machine. Y'all, I can't spit nothing out. That's just all there is to it. All right. This overlapped just a little bit. So let me get it. There we go. Get that underneath there, pull it, there it is, and then push this down, there we go, and then there it is. All right, so I'm going to stick it onto the cover, probably doesn't make a bit of difference, but that's just what I'm going to do, and I just kind of eyeball it, try to give enough room for the sewing machine to go around the edges. There we go. It is stuck a rooney. It's not coming up, but I like to really burnish it, make sure all the air bubbles are out. Okay. Ba bam. There it is. Okay, now this, let me see which direction, make sure everything is kosher, is going to go like that. So let's take this off. 
I always get so nervous, y'all, every single time. Every single time. But, you know, there's always a way. Whoa. Let me get some tweezers to get that. Where are my tweezers? Where are my tweezers? Here's some. Let me get that paper off. There we go. And then stick that down. Scrub good. And then, there it is. All right, so now, let me make sure everything is the way it's, I'm going to get some Fabri-Tac and stick that down. So hopefully, hopefully, that will give me a little wiggle room. It doesn't always do it, but you know, Oh, it is what it is. We, um, it is what it is. I go through way too much, but I feel like I want to really watch the integrity of, um, my, uh, journal. Okay. Double, 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 double. All right, so here we go, it's going down. So I like to try to line up the corners and and it's off just a little and it's a little too late. A little too late, but it looks good. It's gonna be just fine. All right, we're gonna smush that down. Love it. Oh, I already love it. I already love it. Allie, she is just a barking. Hold on one second. Okay, so um, now that I have it stuck together, I am going to um, sew all the way around the edges, and I will be right back. All right, here we go. It is, I sewed, sewed, sewn, sewn, <laughs> all the way around the edge. All right, so now, I'm going to get my scoreboard. Um, if you, um, you can, this is a Stampin' Up! scoreboard. I've had it uh, forever and a day. But, um, I, uh, I really like it. I really like it. So, um, I've not changed just because. But you can find the big scoreboards um, on Amazon. And I think I have one listed down below. But here we go. So I am scoring where this line is right here. And I'm lining it up right here. Okay. I always mark my board. I have it at 4, 6, and 8 with a marker. That way I can line it up down here make sure it's right where it needs to be. So here we go. We're just going to score it. And score really, really well. There we go. There we go. Now it's time to fold it. It's time to fold it. All right, let's ink it so that'll give it a little more time. For the glue in there to dry. Let's ink this up. Oh, I already inked it up. That's right. Duh. Duh. 
All right, let me show you where it's off just a tiny, 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 tiny bit. I don't even know if you can see it, but it'll be pretty. Very, very pretty. All right, here we go. I am going to fold it over right where the score line is. Sometimes um, when there's glue involved, you might want to let the glue dry so that it don't wrinkle. But there we go. There we go. It is right where it needs to be. I'm going to line it up right here. Line it up right there. I always make sure everything is straight as I can get it. Straight as I can get it. There we go. There it is. Cover is made. Cover is made. The cover is made. Yes, yes. Uh, I was going to put... Um, I was going to put um, the uh, the tie in before I closed it all up, but I forgot. We'll just put a little a little grommet thing there and um, do it that way. Let me straighten it up just a little. Just straighten it up a little bit. I'm just not gonna worry about that. It's like an eighth of an inch. I'm not even gonna worry about that. All right, I'm gonna ink that up. There it is. The cover is made, the cover is made. Yay, the cover is made. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, that is so, so pretty. All right, the next video that I make, we will put the pages together. I will show you again the pages and we will, um, um, I will, I may go ahead and cut them out and have them ready to sew in so that it's not like a majorly long video, but maybe I'll just wait, whatever you want me to do. I think I'll, I will go ahead and include the cutting out and all the things with the next video when, um, I make it. All right, there it is. I'm going to, um. I'm going to go ahead and print uh, those pages that didn't print very well, and we'll go from there. I hope you enjoyed this. Give me a thumbs up. Be sure and subscribe and hit the bell, and um, yay, we're making our, our giveaway for our thousand subscribers. Also, go check out my, go, uh, I don't know if it's co uh, coffee or co-fi. Um, it's linked down below. I have a freebie in there for you. Um, I've already uploaded the video. You've probably already seen it. I don't know, but it's the Proverbs 31 woman that is in there. So go check that out. Check out all my, uh, Amazon links down below. Yay. I'm so excited. Y'all thanks so much. And we'll, uh, I'll see you for the next part. Bye everyone.